long time no see, so just an update. It's been a while. We're busy, busy. We're working full time. So update, still working. Miguel still in childcare, but we are going to move him in a different center soon. Cause nice center near just a neighborhood, mga five to ten minutes walk just from our place. So we will move Miguel there. Cause we have center karun it is good actually i feel bad because miguel has settled well there already but like it's so impractical to travel there every day because jeff workplace jeff's workplace workplace is just a uh, five minute drive from our place and then he is just going to drive 15 to 20 minutes just to drop off miguel and then come back again so we're so happy when we found out that there's a center child care center opening just walking distance from our place so we are going to move Miguel there so the center is ready but not yet operating but soon soon maybe first week of April so actually uh, I think last week we have an open day so we went there yes activities so they have they invited some people from the zoo they're like iguana they have snake Miguel have fun in the playground as well I'm surprised he knows how to climb now. <laughs> and then he has some fun in the slide. And they also invited, um, they have like Peppa Pig mascot. And there's, um, and there's Elsa as well. The kids had fun. Today we had a first day, a uh, first orientation. So it's just, so we are going to stay with Miguel for one hour. So there, the scene is not operating yet. So there's no other kids and parents, so just us. So they are booked. They book for each family so just us and we have a look take a look around talk to the educators they will come um, went through yeah. us what's mm -hmm. gonna happen the day to day you know actually it's good i like i like the center so i'm actually excited hopefully miguel it won't take long to settle so we are going to start him off for like two days in a week because my parents another exciting update they will be coming hopefully hopefully soon so i won't be um leaving miguel full time and when they go back home i will um put miguel there for five days so the reason is even if even if my parents are here it's because when they go back home we might be having a hard time finding uh, another center we might not get that center anymore because it's so busy so hard to get a spot so just to keep like that spot for Miguel we're going to still put him there even just twice a week barbecue time so we just got this barbecue from marketplace it's actually huge than the last one we had it's actually nice with baka penoling <laughs> free charcoal let's harvest some of our fruits and veggies i'm gonna get some calamansi i'm gonna use this to marinate my pork so we've moved our plants from the pot to the ground because this calamansi is with us for like more than a year now and it's been bearing a lot of fruits but the fruit is not growing bigger so maybe it needs more space so we move it to the ground because i think this would become taller like a small tree there it smells so good i wish you can smell it i love 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 calamansi we like it's a family of lemon, but love the smell better. This is capsicum, so it has four, and then I already harvested three of these. There, it's so red, so cute, but big yung one veggie. This one is eggplant. I also harvested like about four of these, though I'm not sure if it was ready. Okay, it was very small, and then this one is chili no this is the just the eggplant sorry sorry this is the eggplant the other one was the chili i know this is the chili chili as yes. oh. well what's the other one there's a tomato this is the tomato i don't know if it will survive so this is what we're going to cook for barbecue belly and then this one pork chop pork cutlets so lamit anig na ice stick nga eh tuhog tuhog siya like real barbecue sa philippines but like kuha na kaya big work na kaya so kanina lang yaman sana siya for kuha barbecue 
I just have to marinate it first. So that's all of it. I'm just gonna put patis. This is the Filipino style barbecue. Some calamansi in. The four little calamansi is not enough for this. So I'm just gonna add um, vinegar. This smells really good. I wish you can smell it. I might just move this to one plastic bag para mamarinate yung chatanan. Ito ang um, bag. Here, so they would be marinated like even. Yeah. Starting the barbecue. Oh, so, I do. Charcoal. I like charcoal. Than the nut charcoal. <laughs> Hi Miguel. We cut Miguel's hair by the way about like I think a month ago now. Look at that. <laughs> I miss his long curly hair though, but no. We look like a big boy now. Say hi, Miguel. Hi to the camera. Hi. 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 He's watching his favorite. He has a new favorite. Now he's moved on from to Miss Rachel. From Miss Rachel to Bleepy. <laughs> so they're all done. We actually finished eating already. These are the leftover and we're too hungry and excited to eat. I was not able to take a video. But yeah. Yay! Time for dessert! We're having chocolate mousse. We're actually um, celebrating our 17th anniversary. This is an extension. Our anniversary was last Sunday. Sorry, it's too dark. I'm already in the room. I'm about to sleep. Although for sure, I'm just gonna end up scrolling on my phone for hours. I'm so sleepy already after I eat so sleepy <laughs> because I'm so full but I don't know if I can sleep now I fall asleep a little bit in the couch Miguel is already asleep since 9 um, he's in his crib you can see it tomorrow's weekend yay although my weekend starts today Friday because I didn't go to work today long weekend for me <laughs> But excited for next week because another long weekend next week because of um, Holy Week. Yeah, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Good night.